Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to another Unity tutorial today. And this is about creating some quick gameplay that you can record within Unity using their Unity recorder. And it might be a quick way to get some promotional footage, some things that you want to send a video to somebody. You need to record something to see how it looks and you want to do it directly in the editor. And some people don't know this even exists. So I'm going to show you today how to install it, how to use it and what it can help you do. Be sure to check out my patrons, get access to over 155 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. And check out all the links in the description for all the game dev savings and sales. So in my scene here, I've got my Goku scene that I created with a little turntable that I've also created. So what we can do is you can go to your package manager, which is window package manager. You can make sure that you go to the unity registry in the top corner by filtering, and then you can type in recorder or record, and then you get something called unity recorder, which in this version is 2.5.7 and you can click to download and then you just import that into your project if you haven't already then you can go to window general and then you can go to recorder and the recorder window and you will get this basic recorder you can exit play mode after the recording stops and you can set the recording mode to manual because you want to do this to happen your playback should be constant and i usually like to target 60 fps but you can do less or you can do a custom and i like to cap it just so that we don't need to get any higher fps than we don't need to see so the rest of the settings we need to add our own recorder so in this case we can create an animation clip a movie an image sequence or a gif animation so you've got loads of different options to be able to create something if you just want a gif or whatever it may be but in this case we'll choose movie and then in the movie settings that we've got the source which can be the game view or you can have lots of different sources depending if you want to follow a particular camera or a 360 view you can output the resolution to match with what your current game view is or set it maybe i just want to record in 1080p with a 16 by 9 resolution i can include audio if i really want you can keep the compression as h264 mp4 which is good you can set the quality level obviously the smaller that the quality level is the smaller the file will be and then you can set what the file name should be where you want to save it so that it can be saved in your project panel assets folder or somewhere more specific by clicking the little three dots here and you can choose where that is but i'm just going to record that in my project called recordings and then have this take number and this will increment every time you use it and then let's say for instance we want to start recording from just the get-go if we've got a little animation or a timeline we can just press play here and then it will start up our gameplay and it will start recording the footage like we want and say you want to stop this at any point you, you could click stop recording on the actual recorder itself it will already have incremented the take we've got there what i can now do is go to my recordings inside my project file and you can see that here i've got my video that it's rendered out in the quality that i wanted straight from the game view and as you can see 10 seconds with high quality was around 10 megabytes in size and of course you as i said before you can add gif sequence which will have a similar thing where you can just track the main camera have it the same size of the window and then if you need to remove a particular player you, you can delete or duplicate or anything like that but this is a nice easy way to make some recordings so do be sure to let me know if you've got any tips tricks on a better recorder or anything like that in unity be sure to check out my patreon to get access to over 155 different scripts assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else be sure to check out all my great assets on the unity asset store and on my website for bonus savings and a big thanks to all my patrons including peter steiner Hogland Nigan, Raheem Whitaker, Jean Pommy, Manos Barakas, Terence Conrad, Gage Lindstrom, Walter Dunson, Joseph Newman, Rene Leisure, Topher Chambers, Kreshnik Halili, Christian Selen, Benjamin Shankel, Alex Shen, Alyssa Faden, Daniel Getterjank, Lebrons, Stephen Mormon, Rob Winkle, BJ Pickles, Binto Kebino, Ishkawa Takoya, and Valentin Emil Doll. So thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.